ice dragon? Really? Oh boy, this is bad. Hey, icicle teeth. Icicle teeth, really? It just makes it sound intimidating. Not to me. Ninja, go! Oh, my warriors and boy. Is very powerful. I can't have you interfering. Yeah, who are you? I'm afraid I can't tell you that. Water! I'll just have to do this the normal way. Earth! <laughs> Master Will. I know, but why? It must have been the Ice Emperor. Look, it's my sister. I gotta go help her. Oh, I'm glad you're okay. Can I come? No, it's too dangerous for you. We have to go to our Master Wu. Hmm, huh. I wonder where my students are. Master Wu! It's snowing! And some samurai popped up out of nowhere. We fought them. Then an ice dragon flew in with their leader on it. They stormed the palace. But most importantly, it took the same. same! Wait, did he say what the dragon's name was? I think it was. Bouncy Ball? It was Boreal. Oh no, I have something to show you. We must protect this scroll. This is what he's after. What is that? It's a scroll. It's the scroll for Ben Spinjitzu. For Ben Spinjitzu? Yes, it's a powerful form of Spinjitzu. How do you know what he's after? I have a story. More stories? Why do you know something about every villain we face? Anyway, the original Master of Ice had a son named Vex. He passed on his power to him, but Vex grew corrupted by it. So, with his remaining power, he passed it on to Zane. <coughs> Vex created an army of ice samurai. We fought them. Several elemental masters helped in the process, including me, Cole's mother, Moro, and Formlings, who lived there. The battle was fierce. In the end, we won. Vex and his warriors were banished to the Neville Realm. But during that time, he created the Ice Emperor. That is why it is of extreme importance that you protect it. Let's go to the Neville Realm, then. Wait, I have your new mask. Yes! How do I look? Good. Sensei, I don't have my powers. What do I do? Hmm, allow me to think. Aha, yes, the sword of fire. Thanks, Sensei. 